Hello and thanks for watching. Today I'm showing you my lumber estimator that I created using Microsoft Office. It works e equally as well in OpenOffice or LibreOffice. It's a spreadsheet that's formula based. It allows you to input the dimensions of your building, your building width, length, wall height. It allows you to enter information about doors and windows. It also allows you to enter information about your roof, your gable overhang, your rafter spacing, and it then outputs a list of required lumber. We'll run through this. Let's say we're doing a building that is 20 feet wide by 30 feet long with an 8 foot wall. The spreadsheet has now been updated. It shows you the number of board feet that you would need if you were using 1x4s on the exterior of the building, or 1x6s, or 1x8s, or if you're using 4x8 sheeting, uh, whether it's plywood or, OSB or OSD. Uh, you can get the number right here. It'll show you what's required to skin the outside of the building. It also shows you the stringers, the tops and the bottoms of the walls, and the number of studs based on either 16 or 18 inch spacing, depending on what you're doing for your wall spacing. You can also input information about your doors. I've put spaces in here for up to three different door sizes. So you might be doing a 36 inch by 83 inch rough opening door, and you may have three of those in your building. You may have another door that's larger, maybe 48 inches by 83 inches high, and you have one of those. Uh, the spreadsheet now calculates the number of uh, studs that you'll need for your framing your windows and doors. All of this calculations are done on double studs around windows and doors. They also have double studs on the corners of your walls. If you're doing uh, a gabled roof, uh, it assumes that the roof will be running the narrow length of the building. In this instance, uh, the half of the building length would, or width would be 10 because the overall width is 20. So it's going to figure that you're going to need uh, rafters, the outer wall to the center of the building at 10 feet. Based on your pitch, whether it's a 312, a 412, 512, 612, etc., it shows you the length of the rafter that will be required and the number of rafters. Of course, that's based here on your gable overhang. You might have a 24 inch overhang or an 18 inch overhang. You might space your rafters out to 18 inches. And again, these numbers all change dynamically based on the, what you've input. I have spaces here for up to four different window sizes. So if you're building a building, I put this get together just to help me rough out barns and uh, other buildings like that, but it occurred to me that this might be useful to other people as well, so I built this into a spreadsheet that's usable. Again, this works in OpenOffice, LibreOffice, or Microsoft Office, and I'm selling it on eBay here today for $5. I hope that you find this useful. Thank you.